In a forest, dark and deep, lived a witch who loved to sweep. With her broom, she'd glide at night, underneath the pale moonlight, casting spells with gentle grace in a hidden, secret place, brewing potions, bright and bold, mysteries her cauldron told. Cats and owls, her friends so true, guided her in skies of blue, whispered secrets in the air, witchy wonders everywhere. Hey, how are you doing? In this video, you will learn how to create AI videos, which you just saw in the intro of the video from the AI generated images. And then I also will going to show you how you can create an AI voiceover. So without any further ado, let's get straight into it. Now, the first thing which you want to have for such an AI video is actually the story. So here, make sure that you use copilot.microsoft.com for the story generation, or you can basically use whichever AI model you like to use, for example, Google's Gemini or ChatGPT. For this case, I will use Copilot from Microsoft. Now here, make sure that you go from balance mode to the creative. And I already basically created a prompt for this story. So make a 30 second long story about a witch. Everything needs also to rhyme. So this is very important that it has nice flow with the rhymes. And once you are happy with the prompt, then you can just click on the submit button right here and then just wait for Microsoft Copilot to finish generating your story. Now, this is a simple story for our AI video. Now let's generate images for the video and then we are going to convert those images into the AI video. Now, the one thing which I will do, I will go here and just copy this part of the story because we are going to use it as part of the prompt to generate those images. Now for images generation, I usually use Leonardo.ai. I think it's an amazing tool and it actually can generate a lot of fun images and they are all made by AI. Now, Leonardo.ai is completely free to use. For free use, you get about 150 daily tokens, which you can use for to generate generate images, but I think it's highly underrated tool. And keep in mind that you can use also the link in the video description down below and upgrade to more premium account of Leonardo.ai. And you will get, for example, 25,000 fast tokens resets monthly, which I think it's totally, totally worth it for only about $24 per month, which I think is worth it. Make sure that you sign up for Leonardo.ai by using the link in the video description down below. Now, once you are on here, you will go here to image generation. Now, I recently found out that this fine-tuned models actually use a different amount of tokens. So if you are on free account, you will then need to consider how much of the tokens each model uses. Because for example, if you generate a lot of the images, then you need to be conservative about the tokens which you actually have. For example, Leonardo Lightning uses about seven tokens, but the one which we are going to use for our images in this video, it's called Albi base XL and this one has about nine tokens to generate an image. Now here I already have a simple prompt and right now I'll replace this part of the prompt and paste this one right here. Now you will just basically copy all of your prompt here inside the Leonardo.ai. So that way you will get a ton of images, which you will put then into AI video making tool and you will have around 10 second long video. Now, this is basically the prompt. And then for example, if you create content for short form content, then you will set this one resolution here or aspect ratio to nine by 16. Or if you are making YouTube videos, for example, then you will use 16 by nine aspect ratio, which I am using right now. And this is pretty much it. Then you will click on generate and Leonardo.ai will generate you two images. Keep in mind that with the free account, generating those images, it will take a long time. And if you use the link in the video description down below, you will upgrade to more premium version of the Leonardo.ai and you will get a more ton more tokens and you will be able also to generate more images with all of that tokens. Now here we have two examples of the images. I will use this, the first one. I think this one is really unsettling and quite disturbing actually. And you can click here to download the 
image. Now, once you have all of these images, you will repeat the process and uh, basically generate all of that images. So these images will be then played inside the AI generated video. Now, the most important part here is that we use this tool. Now, Crea AI is nothing new, but they recently announced or released open access to their video AI generation. Now, once you have an account, keep in mind that this, uh, this is completely free to use. This tool is completely free to use. Now here on the first page, you will click on generate videos and now you will see this welcome screen. Click on start and you will see a simple how to use Crea AI video generation here. Now, once this video is played, you can click on open app. And this is how it looks like. Now here we also have some of the presets right here and you can click on trash icon here and remove all of these presets and basically do the same for the prompts as well. Now, as I said in the beginning of the video, Crea AI can actually generate you 10 second long videos without an actual watermark like Hey Peer does or Pixverse does. So here on the right, you will see clip duration. Make sure that you move this one up to to 10 seconds so you will see here 10 and then under the settings here this is also very important by default you will see this aspect ratio to one to one but if you are making videos for youtube for example a horizontal aspect ratio then you will need to use 16 by 9 aspect ratio here or if you are making short form content then please use 9 by 16 here now here you can go back to the timeline and down below you can also see some of the presets for example film animation experience experimental or the render. Now here you can also see on the keyframes, you can click on this and you can even upload your own image or you can generate it using Crea.ai. I will go here to upload and I will use some of the images which were generated by Leonardo.ai. And right now the Crea AI is actually uploading this image. You can see it right here. Now I will also add some of my also pre-generated images like this one right here. And let's also the, add this one right here, for example. So here, for example, we have three images which will be played inside this 10 second long video. I will put this one to the beginning. So at zero seconds, like so. And now we can just enter some of the prompts. So for example, this one right here, you can enter a prompt, for example, a witch in a forest looking angry. Press on enter and then you can and then you can basically extend this prompt until the first uh, or your second image which will be played inside the video then you can basically add another prompt and now basically if you are making a cartoon you will use the animation here but i will just use this film option but you can play with all of that settings have a different look to your videos now here you will click on generate video and just wait now, once the video is generated, let me show you how it right now looks like. So if I click on space, it will play. And you can see here how this AI video generator has some really nice seamless transitions from one image to another. So this is what I really like about Crea.ai video tool. So once you have your video here, you can click on download here. And then for the voiceover, we are going to use the tool called the 11labs.io. If you want to sign up, you can also use the link in the video description down below, by the way. And this is basically the AI generated story, which I used for my intro. And now if I delete it, I will just copy the new one right here. So this one right here, I will copy it from Microsoft Copilot inside the 11 labs and make sure that you are here under the speech tab here. And then under the under the left corner on your screen, you will see here some of the pre-made uh, voices. So for example, I will click here on Lily 
And then you can also see here that I need to switch my model. So I will click on switch here. On top, you have also simple mode or the advanced mode, which I am inside right now. So this is pretty much it. Now you will just click on generate speech and then you will just need to wait for 11labs.io to finish the generation of your voiceover. And once the voiceover generation is complete, you can click on this download button right here, download arrow, and you will get your voiceover on your computer. Now you can put or stitch these things up inside the CapCut from TikTok. This is completely free uh, video editing software, which I think it's quite straightforward to use. Now, this is pretty much it. Thank you for watching everyone. Have an amazing rest of your day. Every single tool used in this video will be linked in the video description down below. Make sure that you use the link to sign up for leonardo.ai as well as for 11labs.io. And with that said, have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you all in the next one. Peace.